What is going on, beautiful people? It's Jacob here, playing more Evolve Stage 2. Picking up from the Assault class again here, we're going to be playing some Renegade Abe. Renegade Abe is one of these, like, weirder characters, because you're not necessarily... Wait, where is it? Am I going here? Oh no, I've lost the, where, what, what, what ability was I looking for? Oh yeah, reloader. Alright, cool. Um, and then, where's the other one at? Speed loader. Okay, cool. So, we're playing Renegade Abe. Um, oh, against Meteor Goliath. Renegade Abe is a little bit different than the rest of your assault group. Um, because a lot of the assaults have some sort of like, big damage like oh this is it now but renegade abe is kind of one of those slow burners because he relies on a lot of his toxin damage and he kind of sacrifices some of his uh damage for more utility um one thing to note is i have a lesser defense matrix so you got to keep that in mind too when you're thinking about putting in pressuring the monster off people because or trying to draw aggro for your team So, got Electro Griffin and Paladin Parnell. This can honestly go one of two ways. We can have a really good game if these guys are good, or a really tough game if these guys are not good. But since we're running some of, I'm, I'm happy we're running a little bit more damage from our team, and Paladin Parnell is going to be u useful in terms of tankiness because I don't have that same draw ability as all the other uh assaults have because of my weaker defense matrix but we'll go straight into it renegade Ebb is all about swapping abilities just constantly swapping which is why you saw i brought the cycle increased cycle speed a well as well as the sorry i'm listening to the little lady in my ears We're gonna go ahead and probably take one of these guys down. Alright, cool. Get a little defense buff. Kinda wanna get the damage buff. So, I like this map, kind of, because it, it adds another layer to the game. But, alright, the monster looks like he's in this cave right now. So I'm going to try to cut him off here. I hope he's coming this way. So I'm waiting. All right. That's fine. I'm going to pop my defense matrix right away there. Ooh. Put down some damage with the... Shotgun here. Reapply my poison. Oh dang. That guy just got wrecked. Dodge oh I did it doesn't look like I dodged that. Why is he trying to eat? My boy Paladin Parnell needs to pick me up with some healing. High key. Alright, nice. I'm just gonna keep trying to reapplying this. I'm trying to re keep reapplying that poison there. We actually took a pretty big beating from the monster in the early stages. Meteor Goliath is a little bit scary. He can definitely output some damage, so you gotta be careful around him. I didn't take a down yet, so I'm gonna be pretty healthy coming up for our next fight here. 
This is an interesting one, because usually we don't... You don't take this much damage from stage 1 monster off the first dome. Usually it's a little bit more even, but we definitely lost that first fight. This guy is playing quick. I know he's like right here. I'm kind of... I'm really far ahead of my team, so I want to be careful. I want my team with me. Trying to cut him off here a little bit. One of the things, I don't know if you guys saw that, but you can you can actually see the Goliath through the wall because I hit him with the poison dart earlier. So, I'm going to back up here, wait for my team to come back. Get really up and close, up close and personal defense matrix. I'm just trying to re reapply poison, and <laughs> this is what makes Renegade Aid so difficult: is trying to balance all these different abilities at the same time. Paladin Parnell is keeping a good job keeping me alive here. Try to take the high ground so I can get a better line of sight on him. Because the more pings you got on him, the less ability he has to juke around. This map is really small, which makes it like pretty easy to stay on the chase. Because there's not a lot of distance the kill monster can actually make which is both good and bad so we're trying to get i'm going to keep some things on him try to keep hitting him with these fucking poison darts i don't know what these things are but He's in the cave with us, so it's gonna, he's going to have a difficult time. Trying to hit him with another slow here. I'm going to come this way to try to cut him off. And then you want to be careful of this pathing where you're like right behind them like the rest of my team is because it's really difficult to catch up to somebody. It looks like Slick Glyph is just AFK. Or maybe he's collecting buffs. I'm not sure. Since it's a small creature that I can eat by myself, I'm going to just go ahead and eat this damage buff. Oh, Slick Glyph has just is ingenious positioning but I'm really far away so I hope he stays alive I want we I wouldn't want to fight him in that cave Careful. Alright, we're, we're hitting that damage up pretty hard this time. Electro Griffin's got a good... Hit him with another combo here. And now that I, now I got stuck in that fire there is when I'm trying to use my defense matrix. My team's playing good this fight really well. Yeah. And there we go. The monster did a pretty good job of destroying us in that first fight, but we picked it up into the that second and third fight. He definitely risked a lot 
too much health and I think Renegade Babe, like I said, is one of those characters. It's kind of just a slow burner. He's not gonna DPS like as much as Markov, but yeah, you can see I did four almost four thousand damage with just the poison alone over time. So and you definitely got to be careful of that. He didn't do a great job of focusing me. I don't think he recognized like the weakness of Renegade Abe, which is his lesser defense matrix. Also, it kind of helps when Renegade Abe runs a little bit more utility. So. Being able to slow down the monster on repeat, and then we get more damage picked up from some of my other hunters. And I think overall, that was a pretty decent game. And I hope you guys enjoyed. Please like, subscribe, comment. Love y'all. Bye-bye.